the best way to show how to do it is to do it myself. Gandhi, Young India, October 23, 1924. Gandhi was sort of famous for this, and again, it puts him in the exact opposite camp and the exact opposite worldview from most military leaders who, from times immemorial, and Clausewitz actually describes this very well, that you send in other people to risk their life and you try not to have to do that yourself. So uh, it's, again, an interesting way in which nonviolence is the opposite of violence. And of course, part of this also is his belief that uh, all human beings are identical at their core. At the core of our being resides the same reality. So he should be able to do anything of significance that another person would be called upon to do. Underneath all of this, I, if I haven't made it completely clear, is this idea of unity. We have so much disunity in our society because of the stratification of work. You know, people who wouldn't dirty their hands, who wouldn't want to get grease on their fingers, end up feeling superior to people who do those kinds of things. So if you wanted to not feel superior to anyone, Gandhi couldn't live with that feeling of superiority or inferiority. You had to get involved in their work. It's as simple as that and as difficult for us to carry out.